Okay, so IAST stands for Indian Institute of Space Science and Technology, and this institute is located in uh, Tiruvannathapuram, okay, Kerala. So yeah, so for North Indian guys, uh, don't take it too hard that okay, it is uh, in Kerala, but it, Kerala is actually a very good place. I'm, I've been here for around four months. I'm loving this place. So. So for admission, I uh, IAST admission happens to JE Advance only. So you have okay. to, you know, there is a separate list you have to apply, and based on your advance score, you will get those ranks. And uh, okay. like that list will be displayed, and you know the drill, right? So okay. at IAST, there are a lot of facilities. Like uh, so, IAST is under Department of directly under Departments of Space. So you know, we kind of have access to all uh, Department of Space facilities. Uh, so that is there and there are like professors here are were actually scientists in isro so okay. thing is like you are actually directly interacting with people who have worked on rockets you know so it's like kind of actually you are getting that complete exposure uh, of what it is actually so yeah. so even in, in even while teachers teach us it is basically uh, experimental based learning so they actually tell you they have to try to give you an image okay this is how ISRO does or you know they even tell you about latest update okay let's say there is one topic they will tell you what currently is going on around that topic you know how SpaceX is doing this or Blue Blue Origin is doing this so like okay. that teachers are very good so and there is a lot of labs like infrastructure is good and you know okay. so what lab I am currently in is like small spacecraft systems and payload center S space okay. so this uh, this lab we actually uh, make small satellites. Student, uh, student only makes like all B Tech, M Tech students are involved, and uh, okay. you know we come together interdisciplinary work and uh, get a uh, get a particular subsystem developed okay. and you know like overall satellite we make here. So uh, like uh, that is there, and uh, in the initial year, IST students like our alumni basically they launch uh, sounding rocket also. They made it at IST, so yeah. that. So such, you know, you you are getting an idea, right? Such huge exposure is there. So if you are, you know, really passionate about space sector, so there is no better place than IAST in India. Okay. That is for yeah, sure. Yeah. So coming to the uh, graduation part. So at the end, you know, uh, like uh, you might have got an idea. You will you will learn, you know, problem solving. So that is, you know, one of the major mantra of life. <laughs> okay. Yeah. And uh, so. And they actually like we are trained in you know what uh, ISRO wants or you know what space scientists are. So we are actually given that exposure uh, how to deal with things, how to deal with that. And uh, education point of view, this institute is very good. So yeah. we actually uh, and one more thing. So for our batch, there was this thing like uh, if we are scoring about seven point five CGPA, we'll get our uh, whole fee refunded. But uh, okay. I guess this semester onwards they have updated the policy, which you can actually find on the current website. So okay. that is there. So yeah, I guess that is it. And yeah, yeah. if someone yeah. has more questions, they can contact us anytime. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Uh, one thing which I am keen about is that uh, how is the research activities being carried out at IAST? Because I am a research guy. Because I want to ask uh, one question on research. So uh, what are the different courses? Uh, Offered by IST like B Tech, M Tech, or PhD. PhD is there or uh... yeah. So so IIT offers uh, IAST offers uh, B Tech, M Tech, and PhD. So B Tech okay. they off uh, like they offer in three branches: aerospace uh, engineering, electronics and communication engineering, and engineering physics. So in okay. engineering physics, actually astrophysics and you know astronomy and solid state physics, these all aspects are also covered. So engineering physics is a dual degree uh, scenario. So you are actually doing your B Tech plus M Tech together. Yeah. And for M Tech also, M Tech also. Uh, so this EC is with specialization in avionics. So okay. for M Tech also, they offer aerospace and you know uh, EC courses, typical courses. And there are PhD students also in both the branches. Even in okay. physics, uh, like chemistry department is also there. So okay. all the branches uh, they offer a PhD. And there is this uh, math department and you know uh, humanities department as well. 